Um, this is a very proud event for the university to be involved with, actually. And we're delighted that uh, the Stroke Association have chosen this gallery to launch this exhibition this evening. Um, this is an exhibition of the work of Richard Cream. And it's a celebration of his achievement as an artist. So, Richard, we're delighted that you're with us this evening. And we all enjoy your work. So, really, more than anything else, this is a celebration of an outstanding, outstanding artist. We've also been delighted to work in partnership uh, with the Stroke Association because this is no ordinary artist. This is someone who has suffered a stroke and has found art a way of helping to recover from that. We're also very proud to be part of Arts for Health, and this has been an important part of our work for many, many years. Richard Cream, of course, is a Manchester icon. Um, his fashion boutique dressed the rich and the famous, and many of you here will have far better memories than I of Richard's enormous contribution to the city, to the creative industries, and to the culture of our fabulous city. When, of course, Richard had his stroke, it wasn't just his life that changed forever, but his family and him. And I think what we're seeing this evening is a remarkable transformation and achievement of a man whose inner soul has been expressed in the work that we see before us today. I think in celebrating his achievement as an artist, it's important that we separate the two, because Richard clearly is an artist of some considerable achievement. I think you will recognise from looking at the exhibition here in the Link Gallery that we are in the presence of someone with truly amazing skills and talents. Now, um, we hope that this relaunch of Richard's career as an artist is just but the start of a new life. And we'd very much like to feel that the, the university can be a continuing part of that relationship so that when you produce new works, we are developing a new art school next door. We're spending £35 million on one of the largest galleries that you'll find anywhere in Manchester, and we hope your work will find a home there in the future. And with the Stroke Association, I think we can demonstrate that through the vibrancy and quality of Richard's work, that there is truly creative life after a stroke. So Richard, you're an amazing example to us all, and to those stroke sufferers, and to those that don't know what the future holds for us, because we could all be in exactly the same situation. So, I'm delighted that the university, in a very, very small way, has been able to be part of this wonderful exhibition uh, of the collective works of uh, Richard. And I'd like to thank you all for coming. I'd like to thank the Stroke Association for supporting this activity. But more than anything else, I'd like to thank Richard for his work, for his generosity in coming and exhibiting it here this evening.